Hello everyone, welcome to my messy bench, my amateur radio station. Today, we're going to use my ham radio here to send a packet radio message up to the International Space Station, which is making a pass near my house uh, in just a few minutes. You can see the green circle that is around, that, that, that's shown around this is the area that uh, I can be heard by the space station. So we're going to send a message, a packet radio message up to the International Space Station. It's going to repeat it and send it back down to Earth. And it should be heard within this circle all over the United States, Central America, Mexico. Uh, so what is packet radio? Well, it is the language of computers is the best way I can say it to the lay person. But here's some APRS packet messaging. This is what it sounds like. Okay, so this is local packet radio that's going on now at my near my house. We use this to send messages locally and around the world actually if I can get my message into one of the local repeaters I can send it a message to a another amateur radio operator on the other side of the world if I want so let me get things set up here and it's getting very close this this thing is moving about 17,000 miles per hour it's going to be on us here before long let me get the stuff set up here so you can see what's happening Okay, this is the frequency we're going to be working off from to talk to the packet radio station on the International Space Station. Space Station. Um, I'll show you my uh, the message I am going to send is right here. I'll go down here to text number three. It's going to say John, comma Florida. EL97, which is my location, and 73, which means the best, best to you and yours with ham radio language. So we're going to make sure we're set up here, and we're going to, oh, I forgot to turn on this. Just a moment, we need to turn on our, our modem here, our packet radio modem here there we go so we're starting to receive packets from the International Space Station and it is the green circle is over us so what I'm going to do here is send a packet right here beacon transmit so I just sent a message to the International Space Station and I'm just inside the circle there by the way it takes 90 minutes about 90 minutes for this station to circle the earth and send another packet all right now I'm going to pause the video here and let's see if we were heard Okay, well, uh, oh, we're getting messages. Oh, there's one. Somewhere in, uh, it's in Spanish language. <laughs> so this message is being, whoever's sending that, is sending it up to the International Space Station, and it's being broadcast part of Mexico, Central America, the Eastern United States, all at the same time. Let's see here. Let me, let me hit the uh, beacon on mine one more time. Okay, let's see here. This is a website here called uh, ARISS.net and amateur radio stations heard by the ISS. Let's go down here. And there's me. Heard 10 seconds ago. That was the packet I just sent up. 
we can go down here and see the actual packet text let's see here w4jfs-9 john florida el9773 there you see it so what has happened here is my packet went up bounced off the international space station it repeated it over that whole area and a station picked it up here on on earth and put it onto the internet let's see uh while i can here let's see what messages have come in so far that okay so we got one from this station uh there's no message this call sign i'll have to look this up k0 k07 sv hello all that's pretty cool Uh, let's see in t4d hello from in for nt 4 I'll have to look up see where his location is there's some more here here's a x3 this is the one that was in Spanish a minute ago this is from the actual International Space Station this is their packet they sent to me rs0 iss that's pretty cool. Let's see what else is up here now. K O K zero K O C. There's no message with it though. I think it's just a one of those stations that receives packets. So there you have it. It is moving quite fast. Should be. Oops. Computer fell off here. Got too much stuff here. Let me, uh, let me pause the video here. So we still have stations coming in. It's moving quite fast. It's I'm still within that circle. But here on this same site, ARISS.net, they put it on a map. So here's all the ones that have been heard around the world lately. You go here to the United States... Look at there, there's me. W4JFS-9, and there was a station over here near uh, the west coast, and then that M NT4D was up there. He's just north of me. So, pretty cool stuff. Let's see who else has come in there. With this list down here of text. There's the NT4D guy. Hello. He's from Orlando. Okay, so I didn't get all the text in it. So, yeah. KE4AZZ. So, anyways. Pretty cool stuff. I don't want to make the video too long. But, as we're sitting here, there's still more messages being heard which are my radio is not uh, decoding all of them probably because of that little bit of static that's in there so anyways that's it some more fun you can have where you can send messages over a large area using packet radio and having a lot of fun at it Thanks very much for watching. I hope you found this video interesting. And uh, we'll catch you next time.